Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Disgaea 2! Let's clear out this first stage of LK City. Now let's see, this battle I'm pretty much going to divide into three parts. Let's see, okay, so we got a few ninjas up on the roof who are ready to ambush us. Then we got a few enemies down here along with the ninja, and then we have the main pack over here. So I want to take out the ninjas up top first. And I think Yukimaru can probably one-shot that guy, or get really damn close to doing that. So, let's see, how are we doing on levels? Okay, we're doing fine. Let's see, well, Krona can't jump onto the roof, so he's not going to be able to help us with that one. But I think Yukimaru can handle this one, so let's see what we can do. Hurricane Slash! Hmm, yeah, that should be good. I think that's enough. Haha! <laughs> Alright! Yeah, Hurricane Slash, really powerful. Okay, so we got the other ninja over there. And I want Tiana to take that one out. But I had to get that one out of the way so that way Tiana could get in range there. Now, she's not going to be able to one-shot that one. So let's go with the good Gaia Blast. If I can get up top there... Just barely. Okay, so go with... Hmm. Yeah, that'll be fine. Yeah, let's just go with that then. I was thinking maybe Roslyn might deal too much damage, but now we should be good. We have more damage than we need, but that'll be fine. Oh. Okay, I didn't think you'd be able to one-shot the guy. Well then. Okay, let's see what else we got. Hmm. Okay, more ice. Yeah, you need a jump stat of, let's see, 32 to get up there, and yeah, we're short of that, so. But anyway, let's see. Well, that guy's not weak to wind, so I want to go with a star spell. So let's see, I think I'll just barely be in range. Okay, go with that. That might not hit him, though. Ninjas have really high speed. So you want to watch out for that. If you can, you want to try and attack them from behind. But anyway, until then, we'll just drop Yukimaru down there. Uh-oh. You can hit me from all the way down there? Wow. That's like a really high height tolerance there. Holy cow. But anyway... Let's see. Okay, how are you doing there? Yeah, let's get you back over here, and then I think you can pretty much one-shot the ninja. Yeah, bow and gun uses are invaluable in this stage. Everything has an obscene amount of evasion. Now, what I want to do, now that I've gotten those guys out of the way, let's move on to phase two. Okay, so if I go there, I should be able to draw the guy out. But you want to be careful, because they actually have a ranged attack now, unlike earlier in the game. So let's see. Let's go up here, since most of those guys won't be able to get up here. Yeah, having all those pairs of shoes really pays off here. This is about the part of the game where your jump stat is going to start to actually matter. Now, fortunately, since I was barely in range, sometimes you can just trick these guys into just using their plain melee attack. Okay, let's see. I'll take that guy out. Okay, let's have Roslyn shoot him in the head. And then, hmm, if I go over here, I could get ambushed by them, so I want to be careful. Well, I can just hit you from here. I'm a little worried about the evasion, but we'll see what we can do. If not, someone else can finish the job. Whoa! Look at that damage! Holy cow! Okay, let's see. Well, now just move forward just a little bit. You want to watch out for the Kunoichi back there. There you are. Let's see. Yeah, you got... Oh, wow. She's got a lot of good stuff. And you want to spread out your party members because she's got Moonslash that can hit a row of characters. 
Oh, I was gonna try and have him heal, but I forgot. Oh yeah, that's right, I've already had him do something this round. Okay, well let's just leave it like that. Basically, I just want to avoid attracting that huge pack of enemies way in the back there. Okay, let's see. Ice. How are you doing? Okay, Roslyn still needs some help. And Adele. Okay. Let's see. I could hit you from behind. So, yeah, let's just have Roslyn slow that guy down a little bit. Take him from behind. And I'm going to back off with Krona there because he's weak to win. And I don't want him getting annihilated by Hurricane Slash. Stannis ailments I can deal with. Uh-oh. I might be in range of these guys. Yeah, they might be able to hit me from all the way over there. So, yeah, let's just throw you back there. Hopefully, I won't draw their attention. And, yeah, I'm just going to have to deal with Hurricane Slash if she decides to use it on me. Or she could just sit on her ass. Why not? Okay, let's see. Okay, well, let's try this. Let's get Rosalind over there. Maybe get... Oh, yeah, she still needs a uh, level. Okay. Okay, well, can we just... Yeah. I suggest a feather touch, Adele. And then a good proximal shot. That should get the job done. Overkill. Now, what I want to do here, I want to take out the ninja, and then I'm going to take out the geo symbol over there that has the enemy boost plus 50% effect on it. But first, let's heal up a little bit. Awesome. And I want Lloyd to take care of the geo symbol because he has the most height tolerance, and I don't want him to get in range of the other enemies. So he has great range and height and distance. Okay, so let's see. Fire. 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 Okay, let's see. If I do that, I think... No, wait, I won't be able to do that with Crimson Flame, will I? Now. Hmm. What's the height tolerance on the 18? Okay, so I need to be up to at least 40. And... Nah, I can't use any of my fire abilities. We're too far. See, Rosalind can shoot the guy, though, at least. And... Hmm. Well, even if Adele can't use his abilities... Or whatever. Maybe I can hit him from all the way down here. Hmm. Let me see that. Yeah, I think I'm a little too close here. And, yeah, I can't do both. I can't have Rosalind hit the guy from afar and... Uh, what was it? Uh, and stay far away as well. So, hmm. Okay, let's go... Try to do a diagonal throw here. That'll be good enough. Okay, so... Yeah, just soften the guy up there a little bit. And let's see if Adele can uh, hit the guy from all the way down here. No? Oh. Oh, I can't even use that ability at all. I just wasted my time. Great. <sighs> okay, we'll have Lloyd do it then. Okay, so hit the guy, and then a good star spell. Haha! -ha! Alright! Yeah, that worked a little better. Oh, I need to get everyone off of the geo panels, or we... Well, we won't die, but it would be annoying. See, can you get out of the way? Well, you're just gonna have to go back home. Oh, I didn't realize those didn't have the the geo effect on them. 
Hmm. Okay, well, anyway. Let's see. Can I hit it from all the way here? Yes, I can. Okay, go like that. And not only will it reduce their stats then, they'll also take a well, little bit of damage that'll help soften them up. You should probably be able to one-chat most of them. Now, the thing is, even though we have three of those guys lined up, and I could hit them all, I don't want to draw them all out at the same time. Like, I could hit them with Rose Thorns or something. So, let's see. Okay, how far can you move, Krona? Pretty good. Yeah, let's go with that. And get as many of us in a plus sign formation so that I can use whatever that ability was. Up. Which one was that? Kneel before me. Okay. For some reason, I was trying to remember the name of the ability and I couldn't remember. I just thought it was something that wasn't going to be that straightforward. But this ought to do the trick. And hopefully they won't go after Lloyd. They shouldn't be able to get to him at all. Okay, good, good. Okay, hmm. Well, let's see. If I do this, and then I could have someone throw her out of the way or throw her to safety. I don't think... Ah, okay. I was going to say, I don't think that's quite enough, but... Well, it's good enough for now. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we'll just go there and throw her out of the way. And... Okay, yeah, let's spread out a bit. Hmm. Yeah, I want to draw the enemies out. So let's go... Like that. And you do the same thing tomorrow. That ought to be good enough. I could have tried to take out the two enemies that were nearly dead anyway. But then they might gang up on Tiana there and... Yeah, that probably wouldn't end well. Ow! See, that's why I was worried about it before. There's a ranged attack. Fortunately though, I got pretty good speed on Yukimaru with all those shoes. Yeah, shoes are just so good in this game. Okay, let's see. Well, we can take care of the leader there pretty quickly. Well, apparently, they don't have as good evasion as the ninjas did. Haha. -ha. Okay, well, let's see. That'll be an easy shot. Okay. Take that one. And then we'll see what elemental weaknesses the rest of them got. Okay, fire. Okay, they're all fire. Hmm. I wonder. Let me see if I can't do something here. I think this can work. Yeah, yeah, this will work. Okay, so throw him there. And assuming I can actually hit those guys. Ha ha! See how well that works on them. Wow, look at that damage! <laughs> oh, I love the character abilities in this game. And now, let's see what else what's going on around here. Overlord Zenon is coming back to life. Oh! You mean he actually was killed? After all that damage. Huh. As long as there are humans nearby, Overlord Zenon will never cease to exist. Oh. But Aren't we no long aren't they no longer human? Except Adele? More humans will be lost to the darkness. That's already been the case, though. But won't ruling the people become more difficult if more of their consciences are drained? Oh, yeah. That is not our concern. We are meant to serve. I have begun to question whether it is right for us to exist like this. What do you mean by that? I wonder if I have forgotten anything important. Ever since I met that young man. Now, nah, that couldn't possibly be true. Young man? Yes. That young man with pure eyes. What about him? You're not gonna tell us, are you? Nice. Oh, now I remember. Oh, maybe the curse is weakening. 
What do you remember? Was it how to brush your teeth? <laughs> that was mean, honey. Yeah. And no, that still looks too complicated. I remember something about Adele's parents. Oh, really? Really? What is it? What do you remember? What's that? What's going on? Um, what were we talking about? <laughs> uh, what do you mean, what were we talking about? You were going to tell me what you remember about Adele's parents. Yeah. What's going on? <laughs> I love boobies! Really, game? What was that? <laughs> That's not a pimple. What was the point of that? Hmm? What is this evil in the air? Yeah. Well, we're demons. Huh? Most of us. Tardo? Did your horns just get a little bigger? What? Stop making things up. Uh, Hanako, did your wings just get a little bigger? Oh, huh. hmm. Really? All right! I'm on my way to becoming a mature woman! What do you mean by that? Don't answer that, viewers. <sighs> what was that dark feeling? You noticed it too? It looks like Zenon's curse is growing stronger. Hmm. Sir Adele, you seem to have been unaffected by Zenon's curse, Sam. Yeah, that is weird. Yeah, Zenon's curse doesn't work on me. Really? Is it an ability you were born with? Or are you wearing some kind of magic shield, Sam? I've got a plot shield. It's not because of some item. I guess I was just born with it. Yeah, just look in my status menu. Wow, that's very interesting, Sam. Maybe Sir Adele is the Chosen One, sent here to defeat Overlord Zenon, Zam. But he's already dead. Evidently. Yeah, that was weird. I wonder what Axel's been up to lately. Anyway, find out next time on Let's Play Disgaea 2. This is H.G. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.